welcome to Isabel Explains. In this super short video, I will show you how to simplify a fraction this big. So the first thing that you're going to do when you're simplifying any fraction is that you're going to find the greatest common factor between the two numbers, right? In this case, you have two big numbers. That's a lot of factors to look for. So my advice is start with a smaller number. So in this case, we're gonna look for the factors of 171. Now, we know that 171 is an odd number, which means that it's not gonna have any even factors. So we can skip all of those. So we start with one and 171. Then we go to three, it would be three and 57. We go to five, we know that five is not gonna be a factor because this does not end in zero or five. We go to seven, we check on the calculator, we see it is not a factor. We go to nine and we see that it is nine and 19. Then we go to 11, and if you saw my other video on tricks with the table of 11, you will see that this is not a multiple of 11 because one plus one is not seven. Then we go to 13, we see that 13 is also not a factor. We go to 15, cannot be a factor because this does not end in five or zero. We go to 17, is also not a factor, and then we go to 19, which is a factor already, but we already found out, so we don't need to do anything else. We're done with that one. What we're going to do next is we're going to see which one of these factors is also a factor of the bigger number. And we start with the biggest number first. So we see that 171 is not a factor of 228, but we see that 57 is. So what we're going to do is we're going to divide 57 top and bottom and we get three over four and bam, done. That is how you simplify a fraction that big.